Esports players who are at a professional level all seem to have this intense focus and devotion. They're able to dedicate most of their waking hours to training their skills without ever seeming to lose motivation. They're fully locked onto their target, whether that's becoming the greatest player or preparing for an upcoming tournament. And no matter what, they seem so unshakable, completely unwilling to stray from their goal until they've achieved it. And as an ambitious competitive gamer, you've probably been inspired by pro players who are like this and thought to yourself, I would love to become a pro gamer. But chances are your next step was to hop back into a match like usual and keep playing while that thought and that dream slowly drifted to the back of your mind. And this process isn't uncommon. Most ambitious competitive gamers are aimlessly playing with a distant hope that someday they just might reach the pro scene, yet they're on the track to be distracted, hit obstacles, or simply lose motivation. And the reason for this is because they don't have an actual plan. They don't have a proper goal for actually achieving that dream. And if you truly desire to become a pro gamer, the first step is creating a proper plan to get there. You can almost think of the journey to the pro scene as an adventure across the ocean. You need to properly set your course, identify the path to get to your destination, and then implement the proper plan for getting there. Without setting your course or having a plan of action, you're essentially sailing off in a random direction without a clear path or even a clear destination. But when you know exactly where you want to go, you know exactly how to get there, your journey becomes much, much easier. So if you have the ambition or a distant dream of becoming a professional esports player, then it's time to turn that dream into action. It's time to plan your path to the pro scene. The human brain is a complex machine, collecting tons of information through each of our senses. And if we were constantly aware of all this incoming data, constantly noticing every inch of our skin, every slight scent, or being aware of everything we saw and heard, our mind would be completely overwhelmed with information. And so, through a section of the brain called the Reticular Activating System, or RAS for short, the brain determines what information is actually relevant and worth keeping, and what we can ignore. A perfect example of your RAS at work is when you discover something new and you start noticing it everywhere. Such as when someone in your family buys a new car and suddenly you seem to see that exact same car everywhere you go. And the reason I bring up your RAS is because it's this part of the brain that makes setting goals so powerful. Because when you set a compelling goal and you constantly keep it in your focus, you begin to influence your RAS to help you achieve that goal faster. Your RAS begins to filter out other distractions and increases your awareness of opportunities in favor of your goal. In other words, by setting a goal, you essentially are programming your brain to enhance your focus and discover new opportunities to get closer to the pro scene. And so the first step to becoming a pro gamer is to define your objective and then begin to clarify what it will take to achieve it. And by simply doing this, you'll begin to change your brain and program it to subconsciously notice new opportunities and help you to stay focused. Unfortunately, most people fail to take advantage of this. They make a big mistake when they're setting their goals. And that big mistake is that they set their aim too low. Because most people are convinced that they can only accomplish mediocre things, they tend to set mediocre goals, and they struggle to actually achieve them. And this happens for the simple reason that if we set mediocre, realistic goals, we find it hard to develop the enthusiasm to jump over even the smallest of obstacles in order to accomplish it. But if we have a clear, exciting goal, we will be willing to battle through just about anything in order to achieve it. So the first step to setting your goals is to make sure that you're setting your aims high and creating plans to reach an exciting outcome. 
whether that is to win a specific LAN tournament, get into a prestigious college with an esports scholarship, or actually make it onto a prestigious team. And whatever this big goal is, let it be your guiding star for your smaller goals. Let it act as a compelling destination that will make all the effort worthwhile. Now the second step is to break this big long-term goal into smaller steps. So consider, what steps do you need to take in order to get to this big goal? For example, your first step might consist of achieving a certain rank or level of skill. Step two might be to find a semi-professional team or organization that you can start to enter tournaments with. Step three might be to seek out local tournaments or seek out online tournaments that you can enroll in. And step four might be to reach out to pro-level teams once you have the tournament track record and leaderboard ranking that they can't look away from. So once you have your overarching long-term goal and the general steps to achieve it, it's time to break down each step into immediate measurable goals. For example, your first step might be to achieve a master level rank. And with this step in mind, you can begin brainstorming exactly what you need to do in order to achieve this rank. Now, of course, to rank up, you'll obviously need to improve your game knowledge in mechanical skill. And as a place to start, you might focus on one specific skill. If you're playing an FPS game like Overwatch, CSGO, or Call of Duty, this might be your gun accuracy. If you're playing another game like a MOBA, it could be something as simple as your creep score. Whatever skill it is, define it by a specific number, whatever your average is at this point, and then set a goal for what you want to improve it to. With an example of in-game accuracy, perhaps your accuracy is around 18%, and then you decide that you want to improve it to about 20 or 22%. In order to do this, you realize the best way to accomplish it is by practicing in bot matches for at least an hour every day. And so your immediate goal is to improve your accuracy from 18% to say 22% by practicing one to two hours per day in a bot match. Once you've successfully accomplished that small goal, it'll be time to move on to the next one. And so the key here is to continuously break down each step into small immediate goals that you can actively measure and work towards every single day. And as a side note, if you have trouble figuring out what skill you should be improving, perhaps do a little bit of research on YouTube or maybe even check out our video on skill development. But to sum up the process of creating your plan, set a compelling, exciting, and long-term goal, something that gets you excited. Perhaps this is to get sponsored by a gaming organization. From there, break down that big goal into smaller steps. Perhaps step one is climbing from diamond rank to master rank, and then using online platforms to enter tournaments, and finally reaching out to gaming organizations once you're at a high enough skill level. And then finally, break down those steps into actionable smaller goals, things that you can work towards every day. Often this will mean breaking down your skill development into specific skills so that you can measure your progress and improve every day. And to take this all a bit of a step further, write down your goals and display them somewhere where you'll continuously see them and continuously be reminded of them every single day. One of the best ways to do this is by writing down your goals, taking a picture of it, and making that your screensaver on your phone or on your computer. By displaying your goals like this, you'll constantly be reminded throughout the day of what you need to accomplish next, and you'll be programming your brain to be attracted towards that bigger goal. In the realm of esports, it is hard to find ambitious players who are equipped with the mental skills to actually make their dream a reality. And as a result, most players gain a surge of inspiration and an idea that they'd love to become a pro, only for this idea to become distant, to become a fleeting vision that fizzles out. But with the proper plan of action and conscious effort to set goals and make progress each day, an ambitious player like yourself is much more likely to discover the path to the pro scene, to navigate past the biggest hurdles, and to actually become a professional player.
Hey guys, I hope you loved this video and I hope you got a ton of value from it. And if you guys want to see more videos like this, you can now support the channel by getting yourself some eAthlete merch. It's been a long time coming, but we finally have the entire merch store set up and honestly, everything looks amazing. So grab yourself a new esports jersey, mouse pad, or even a hoodie and start repping eAthletes. The link for this shop as well as a discount code will be in the description down below. And of course, this video is also brought to you by our very own esports supplements, eAdvantage. Now the inspiration behind eAdvantage is to help competitive gamers like yourself to get a focus and energy boost beyond any sort of energy drink and to do so in a much healthier way. So essentially what we did is we took the beneficial ingredients that you might find in an energy drink and added even better ingredients and packed it all into a small capsule. And as a result, you get a huge focus boost and even a memory boost in a much healthier and cheaper way. So to try out eAdvantage for yourself, you can use the code EATHLETE1 to save 6.5% off your entire order. And the link for eAdvantage as well as this discount code will be in the description down below. And of course, as always, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you get so much value from this video, and I'll see you all in the next one.